Hey crow friends, I'm Bianca Renee and you're watching Bianca Renee today and today I am finally going to review these brand new curly hair products. Introducing the new not your mother's curl talk line. I literally just now realized that these products are called curl talk like that's the name of one of my segments on my channel. I basically invented these. Okay, fine, I had nothing to do with these products, but I'm so excited to try them. I love the name, love the packaging. It has little curly, little purple curls on the top. I love purple and I love these products. So in the line, you get a shampoo, a three-in-one conditioner, a gel, a styling cream, and a mousse. But here's the thing about the mousse. All the other products are sulfate, paraben, and silicone-free. Except this naughty little guy right here. And I was really sad because I really wanted to just be able to be like, you can get anything in the Curl Talk line, not your mother's Bianca Renee approved, easy peasy. But then I had to read that little fine print with the asterisk that said, except the mousse. But they didn't lie about it. There's nothing on the bottle that says it's a silicone free. That's why it's important to always read the labels. So don't just go by the brand. But I contacted Not Your Mothers and I told them that I will not be able to review this because of the silicone. And I'm not gonna lie to you guys. I'm pretty sure that's why you guys follow me because I always keep it real. And they told me that they're actually going to remove the silicone from the mousse. Can we just give that a round of applause for a second? Like that's what I'm talking about. Apparently a bunch of people were complaining about the silicone because that's just not what us curly people want. So I respect a brand that listens to their consumers and just gives us what we want. Like we're gonna spend the money. We're all product junkies. If you give us something good, we're gonna buy it. We have a problem and we know it. So for the sake of this video, I will only be trying the shampoo, conditioner, the gel, and the styling cream. And then I probably will revisit the mousse when it's ready to be reviewed. Now the greatest thing about all these products is the price. They're only $7.99, literally all of them, shampoo, conditioner, gel, styling cream, mousse, all the same price, all $7.99 across the board. That makes things really easy and it's so affordable. You're also getting really decent sized products. The shampoo, conditioner are 12 fluid ounces. The defining cream and the sculpting gel are six fluid ounces. They both have squeeze bottles for the styling products, which I like. The shampoo has a interesting little squeeze nozzle, but then the conditioner has a pump. Don't know why they put the pump on the conditioner. Kind of makes it hard to do in the shower, but you know, we're gonna make it work. So in today's video, I'm gonna give you a full review of all of the products starting in the shower with the shampoo. This is the Not Your Mother's Curl Talk Curl Care Shampoo. The shampoo is sulfate free, which is the main important thing to look for with your shampoo. It's supposed to cleanse your hair and hydrate it for enhanced curl retention. And as you can see, it is bubbling up, so you will get that lathering sensation, even though it doesn't have sulfate. After the shampoo, I rinsed it out and then grabbed the Not Your Mother's Curl Talk 3-in-1 Conditioner. This conditioner is 3-in-1, meaning it's a leave-in, a rinse out, and a co-wash. So that means you could leave it in as a styler after the shower. You could use it after your shampoo, like a normal conditioner and rinse it out. Or you could use it in between washes when you don't want to cleanse your hair with the shampoo. So it has a cleansing agent in it as well, besides giving moisture to your hair. So since it is a three in one conditioner and it also is a leave in, I didn't rinse it out in the shower. I just kind of detangled with my fingers and then I squeezed out any excess product and just left any remaining product in my hair. I do think I would prefer a pop-up top like the shampoo for the conditioner just because using a pump in the shower gets a little complicated, but obviously what's important is what's inside. I did think this had really good slip. I love the smell and it's very lightweight, not too heavy. The scent doesn't linger on your hair after you get out the shower. And I was very, very happy with it and it doesn't have any silicone. Now let's get out the shower and move on to the styler. I am someone who loves a good gel. So of course I grabbed the gel first. This is the Curl Talk Frizz Control Sculpting Gel. Anti-frizz and flexible hold for flake free firm hold. Now if you look on this little chart right here, this is a level three in the hold department. I probably would still be okay with like a four or a five because I do like a little bit of that crunch, but I think this is the perfect amount of hold that everyone will be happy with. Now let me cut back to the day where I used the gel. 
So when I apply the gel, I always apply it on wet hair, I apply a good amount, and then I scrunch it and rake it through my hair, smoothing it through my ends and then scrunching it back up for definition. I do this on both sides just to make sure that all of my hair is covered. Since I have bangs, I do put some more on the top and focus on my bangs. So that was day one. Today is actually day two. So the curls you're looking at right now, day two hair, and I'm getting amazing volume. I think I did get more hold on the second day, not applying it on straight up soaking wet hair. And as you could see, I got some really, really pretty curl definition. Look at this one. Look at these, look at, look at that. Oh, I couldn't even separate these because they were just so pretty. I just added some water, added some gel, and that is how defined they became. So I am so, so happy to say that I love the gel. The gel is Bianco approved, only $7.99. It has a great hold. It doesn't make your hair too hard or crunchy, but just enough to give you that cast where when you scrunch it out, my hair is soft and volumized again. So that's how my hair looked with the gel, but today I use the defining cream. The defining cream is supposed to lock in moisture, defrizz, add shine to those curls. All right, let's see about that. So this is where I applied it to my hair. I used it to refresh on day three, added some more water, then I applied the cream all throughout my hair, smoothing it in and scrunching it up. Then after I let it dry, it looked just like this. Oh my goodness, look how defined my curls are. They look very shiny, so, just so beautiful. I'm loving these results. So what you're looking at right now is actually, how my hair ended up looking. Day three hair using just the cream to refresh. Another really important thing that I have to tell you guys that I'm so excited to be able to share is that all these products are made from a rice curl complex. So their main ingredient is not coconut. I know so many of you have wrote me saying that you're either allergic to coconut or your hair just does not like coconut, but coconut is like in every curly hair product ever. So this is a great alternative to those of you that don't want to use any type of coconut oil. But we found something people, the answer to your anti-coconut needs. All of these Not Your Mother products are sold exclusively at Ulta Beauty right now and oh! Ulta Beauty, that just so happens to be the place where my photo is currently on the wall. So if you guys go to Ulta anytime soon around this video, you might see my photo up on the wall. Make sure you take a picture and tag me so you guys might enter my Ulta giveaway. But go get these products, they're amazing, Bianca Renee approved. You only can get the defining cream and the gel as of right now, today in August, but the shampoo and conditioner are coming soon early September. So you can get these right now as of today of this upload, check the date. But then early September 2018, you can get the shampoo and conditioner. The mousse is also available if you guys don't mind silicone. I guess you can get it. But I would personally suggest waiting until they remove the silicone and then getting the new version of the mousse. So I don't know when that's gonna happen. Make sure you guys follow me on Instagram, Twitter, and Snapchat at Ms. Bianca Renee so I can let you know on my stories and you'll be the first to know when the mousse is Bianca approved. But hey, Not Your Mothers gave us some amazing products to work with right now. I am fine with my gel and my styling cream. I don't know which one I like better. I honestly think I thought I was gonna like the gel more, but that cream, that cream kind of did its thing today. I don't know, if you want more hold, get the gel. If you live in a humid area, get the gel. If you're worried more about moisture and your hair looking like dry, then I get the cream. I haven't cocktailed both of them together yet. That's probably gonna be my next experiment. Once again, follow me on Instagram so I can show you how those results look at Ms. Bianca Renee. And I'm gonna try the cream first, followed by the gel and see how they get along together. I mean, that's what I know you guys like to do. I like one product to work on its own. And they both work on their own. If you enjoy my curly hair product reviews, make sure you give me a thumbs up and subscribe. I post two new videos every week, curly hair videos on Sundays and Foundation Fridays on Friday. And if you've tried these products, please leave me a comment down below and let me know how well they worked for you and your curls. Hope to see you guys in my next video. Thanks for watching Bianca Renee today.